This is a Hammond multiplex typewriter, made in 1919. Unlike a standard typewriter, where letters are punched into the paper, the Hammond punches the paper into the letters. The alphabet, numerals, and other characters are located on a rotating shuttle made of hard rubber. When you press a key, the shuttle rotates to the correct letter. A spring-powered punch called the hammer then presses the paper into the correct letter on the shuttle. One of the advantages of the Hammond design was the ability to buy new shuttles and swap them out. Shuttles with special characters for mathematicians, pharmacists, chemists, and doctors were available, as well as a large variety of languages. Hammond's typewriters from this era were nearly always painted black, but less than 20 examples of an olive green version survive today. It's speculated that the green versions may have been issued to members of the military or government. Former President Woodrow Wilson famously preferred Hammond typewriters, and a green Hammond multiplex typewriter used by Wilson himself was gifted to President John F. Kennedy in 1962. That typewriter is now on display at the White House Museum.